Hey, everybody, where's this guy going? Hey. Okay, he's Thalmor. Those bad guys. I'm Calcelmo's nephew. I help him around the laboratory. I have things to study. You have my gratitude. As promised, it's the key to this one-run museum. It's time to display it. Oh, really? Hmm. If you're buying stuff, it would be good to see any notes you may have collected. I doubt it. Data. I assume the yarl is in here. Here to see the yarl. Fuck like we're going. Wait, what quest do I have in here? Oh, I need to tell that dude that the hall of the whatever is whatever. According to this, he's over here. Oh, he was right outside the door. Turn. The vines preserved here. Take my amulet as we will. Okay, protect. Okay, there we go. So let's go ahead and get out of here. So back to this topic I've been talking about for the past two days in bits and pieces. Uh, with, so like, I don't, I haven't played Dark Souls, but I know what the story of Dark Souls is. And I've watched people play Dark Souls. And I'm not so sure in that game you fucking ever know. I mean, maybe you can, but... It doesn't seem like that game really gives a flying sh fuck about the plot. And I think the what what they mean when they say the plot of an RPG doesn't matter. Oh, uh, there's my horse. I think what they mean is the game itself could have any storyline. You know what I'm saying? Like, the story is just the excuse you need. I guess if you see it like that, though, then isn't the plot of every game not, like, necessary? I don't know, now I'm having, like, a quandary. Is anyone else out here? It says I'm hidden, but someone sees me. I don't understand. I'm sure I can't be. Yeah, he's an orc. I'm just here on a holiday. Yes, well, perhaps someone else in the village can assist you. Please, you're starting to frighten me. I don't see anyone else. Let's see if I've done it yet. Quest. No. Somebody sees me. This is getting silly. Come on, you. 
What counts as a hiding place? Where do you go? Alright, where? Let me move. Let me over here. Come on, Lydia. Good girl. These are there. Yeah, he is. There we go. I dragged it to a hiding place. But fuck nowhere. Alright. Am I returning to base? Yes. Alright. Him being at the bottom of the lake wasn't a good enough spot. Him being right beside a lake. Now that's something. Friends of the Jarls in Falkreath, Hildebarn, Pale may buy lands and build. Let's put our guns away. Hey, Shadowmere. I should get on the horse when I fast travel, because I believe you actually... Now, the time is the same, but, like, in the game's time, it's different, depending on if you're on a horse or not, I believe. I think the biggest thing about the horse is you can travel at full speed while you're over-encumbered. So, you know, you could kill your dragon and then hop on your horse. Why am I not talking to you about this? Oh, yeah, I still got to talk to, like, old man Dingus. He had a farm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so I gather. It seems a certain orc has disappeared. Which means you not only killed the orc, but disposed of the body as well. You got the writ of past. Ah, and word has come in from Markarth that the keep's cook has Cooks. an untimely demise. Your duties to the letter. ABC, baby. <laughs> I was wrong about you. I see that now. Alright, is it time for me to kill the Empire Roar? Yes. And a little something else as well. From me. It's called the Night Weaver's Bag. I won't. Who? You better get a move on and see Ash. Whoa! She just grow? Did you see that? Oh, because they couldn't animate her watch a shrink. If I can get her to leave it, watch, watch, watch. That's amazing. That is amazing. That is amazing. You have to be a certain height to reach the thing, so instead of animating her a way to be up there, she just expands to be big enough. Oh, let's see what he gave me. Items. It was armor. It's like band of... A ring. The, no, it's not that. Nightweaver's band. Sneaking is 10% better. Destruction spells cost 10% less. My ring is destruction spells cost 15% less. Five percent increase for 10% better sneaking. Alright, we'll, we'll hold on to it. Said at least. Alright, it's time to murder us an impulse roller. Castle Dower in solitude. Present will gain unrestricted access to the kitchens, and then the Emperor. Here, all it takes is one taste, and the effects are quite immediate. Once Mead has been killed, escape through the upper door and across the bridge. I now go, my friend. Go and fulfill your destiny as listener. Until next time. I think you're supposed to dress up as the gourmet before you do this. Nope. Alright. Fuck it. Uh, after we do this quest, or after we finish this guild, we might take a break from guilds for a little bit and just do other quests. Because I really feel like it's been way too long since we went like dungeon diving. Because that's the only problem with the Assassin's Guild, the Dark Brotherhood, you know, whatever you want to call it. Oh no, I'm pretty sure I'm wanted here for like 2,000 wing wings. We'll just pay it, I guess. We got like $4,000. Should we go thing of everywhere? Oh, this could be bad. Could be good. Probably bad. We'll see. We'll just we'll run. New in town, right? 
I don't even see any guards. That tail looks so goofy. I guess these guys don't give a shit. Stop right there. Power is off limits until further. What's this now? Yeah. Order of his eminence, possessor of these papers. The gourmet. By Osram. Gourmet. I I'm sorry. I didn't realize. We had no idea who to expect. <laughs> you look just like the leader of the companions. Oh, this is great, as I recall. Uh, I know something's coming, but for those of you people who don't know, I'm just gonna shut up and enjoy the ride. I'm here to cook a delicious dish. Who wants some pizza? You need all of these chef hats. Wouldn't that be great if they didn't give you the chef hats and you were just expected to have one? Okay. Why did I take my clothes off? Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. I see. Uh, then yeah. We'll do it like this. Mmm. Mmm. Excellent. Ladies, oh, I'm still wearing shoes though and gloves, just not my clothes. Oh, just look at you! Absolutely brilliant. Now, now <laughs> Jesus now, Christ! Of course, requested your signature dish, the potage le magnifique. I've taken the liberty of getting it started, but the cookbook only says so much, and everyone makes the potage differently. I would be on the base broth is already. We can get started right All right, what should she add next? Which ingredient should I add next? She should add... Carrots, a sweet roll. <laughs> Remains... Oh, yeah. Sweet roll. Ooh, how decadent. I never would have guessed it. What next? You must now... The next ingredient is vampire dust or splashing meat. Oh, vampire dust. Vampire dust? Seriously? Oh, yeah. Hmm. Yes, I guess I can see how that would add a more... And <laughs> oddly enough, we have someone here. And oddly enough... Do have some on hand. All right, what next? Then? Ice. We shall now add a giant's toe and near root. Let's add a near root. Really? Oh, I use nim root as a special seasoning all the time as well. What a wonderful idea. Okay, now what? You must add a septum or dice horkery. Yeah, plus septum. A septum? As in a gold coin? Really? Yeah. Ah. That would give the potage le magnifique a slightly metallic but delicious aftertaste. <laughs> Simply brilliant. I have to say, the stew seems done. Add anything else and we may dilute the distinct flavors. So, uh, is that it? We're done. should be ready for us now. And if I may say so, it has been an honor getting a chance to prepare a meal with, well, the best chef in the entire empire. I'll carry the stew pot and lead the way up to the dining room. I'm sure the emperor and his guests are dying to meet me. Alright, uh, let's put our clothes back on. Let's say, I don't know if we can actually walk in there without the chef hat on. I am the gourmet slayer of dragons. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going, and the quest marker says to follow you.
Wait a minute. <laughs> oh. oh, how marvelous. Just delicious. It is everything I had hoped it would be. Please, everyone. Yeah, do so, man. <laughs> do we just stand here? How is it? How is it? You're great. I've been waiting for this opportunity for a long time. Keep it together, Gianna. Keep it together. Keep it together, Gianna. Maybe when this is all over, you could sign up your program. Are you a guard? Oh, you're here. Obey. This is such an honor. Alright, give it like three more seconds. If nothing happens, I'll, I'll nuke this guy. Oh, dude, wait, sweet rolls. I got a dish to cook real quick, like. Oh, well, excuse me. You didn't see that though, right? Where's Lydia? Lydia left me. Okay. I'm gonna find whoever did. By God, the gourmet has killed the emperor. No. Gotta get out of here. Oh, it's just dead end. Oh, it's a death. It's a death. Door, door, door. Nobody help. Give me those. No, no, no. Come on, Leia. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Oh, wait. Who's clapping? Someone's clapping. This is behind me. And was by far the most insufferable decoy the Emperor has ever employed. Who's talking? Vlad is dead. You, you assassin of the Dark Brotherhood, just made an attempt on the Emperor's life. You would have succeeded had it been for you. Was it that guy? Surprised? So was I, a member of your family. The plan. We worked out a deal. An exchange. That ain't good. I get you, and the Dark Brotherhood gets to continue its existence. It's gotta be that guy. But you know what? I've changed my mind. How about this? I kill you and put your feet in This never works well for you guys. Your sanctuary is being put to the sword right now. That's what I think of this deed. You killed my son. All of you. And now you'll pay the price. Kill him. Make sure there's nothing left to bury. No one is there. <laughs> Thanks for the scratch. Hey, he was married. Oh shit, he was married. I didn't even know that. What's up, Lydia? What you doing, girl? Leah's bared witness to more crimes than I think any human being in Skyrim. I know I'm almost out of time too, don't worry. But we'll, uh, we'll do this. Oh shit. We escaped. Uh, 
I guess I'm supposed to go to the Brotherhood. Oh, I can't. Shit. Well, hey, I think my bounty actually went lower. Because I thought it was actually like 2,000 for killing all those people. God, jail time seems like the worst. I don't know, your gold's kind of... I don't know. I don't think worthless is the right word. But it's not that useful. Alright, uh, I'm going to start riding to the place. I'll see you next time when I get there. In Skyrim, away!